Scotland in dark shirts kick off against England in the last rugby international of the season. And it's a determined side they're fighting, for an English victory will make a clean sweep of the Calcutta Cup, the International Championship and the Triple Crown. At first, Scotland managed to hold their own in the loose, but only just. They stopped some English rushes, but their own three-quarter line isn't quite fast enough to break through the English defence. Every time, the English forwards are onto them like a pack of wolves. Smith tries to kick, but Butterfield grabs it and streaks for the line. Butterfield to Davis, and he's over. No luck with the conversion, but England start the second half three up and fighting hard. Fullback Chalice takes a penalty kick for England. And now they're six up, but Scotland soon have their chance to reduce the gap with a penalty of their own. Ken Scotland takes it. And it's a beauty. England three quarters are on the move again. It's a change to see some open play after all the mud bars we've been having recently. Dangerously near the Scottish lines again. Phil Davis is brought down. It's loose, but the ref calls for a scrum. Higgins gets it away. He's brought down, but passes to Peter Thompson, who bulldozes through for a magnificent try. And Bob Chalice makes sure of the extra couple. Not long to go now, and the powerful English scrum are really on top of the game. Right in front of the post, they heal the scrum half Jeeps, who's pulled down. A quick scramble, but standoff Bartlett is there, and he gets it away to Higgins. And it's over the line for the final try, clinching England's three-in-one victory. What a finish to the season.